friends and welcome today i have another magical unboxing for you and this time it is from geek gear wizardry box it is their october box and the hint for this month is the goblet of fire i'm so excited to see which items they put inside this box i'm hoping for some replicas or maybe a mug that looks like the goblet of fire that would be so cool Anyways, if you like this kind of magical unboxings, don't forget to click that subscribe button and hit that bell so you never miss another video of me again. Enough talking, let's get unboxing. For those of you that don't know Geeky Wizardry, they are a monthly subscription box and you pay around 25 pounds. That does not include your shipping cost, and they promise you six or more items that have to do with Harry Potter and or Fantastic Beasts. And so far, it has been an awesome experience to unbox their boxes, and they just make my life a little bit more magical, and that is always a good thing. So, for today, we have this box. It feels heavier than normal, so let's find out what's inside. Okay, that's enough. Let's put the box beside me and let's just grab the first item that we find. And I think that that was a t-shirt. So, okay, here we go. <laughs> oh, that is so cool. Okay, this is freaking cool. Oh, yes. Okay, so the t-shirt. I think this is representing all oh, the basilisk and the diary of tom riddle that is cool and i love the black and green those go well together next up is a box and it is a wizardry tea tin okay this could be cute i mean if they chose a cool design Oh, that is cool. Yeah, yeah, this is a nice one. Okay, so it is representing the Marauders map. And it says, um, I solemnly swear that I'm up to no good. No, it doesn't say that. It says, I solemnly swear that I love my tea. Oh, that is, yeah, that is cool. <laughs> okay, next up is something I can see that is in bubble wrap and that means it's fragile so it is a tiny mug oh my gosh oh it says oh this is cool it says amartensia love potion hogwarts apothecary department look how tiny it is <laughs> i don't know why i like this so much but i just think it's so cute and it even has a pink um inside uh, yeah this is cool i mean oh and this is also a harry potter uh official little mug and yeah it's to hold your love potion okay next up is oh hold on yeah i have something and it is tea yeah it is tea and this time we got the Basilix Blood Tea. Oh my gosh, it is Wild Cherries Black Tea. That, that sounds really yummy. <laughs> okay, so not a lot of ingredients this time. Good job. Uh, black tea flavoring and blackberry leaves. So it's quite a simple tea, but it does sound really good. So. As always, let's take a little sniff. Ooh, yeah, I can smell the, the cherries. Yeah, it smells, it just smells like cherries. It smells really good. So, <laughs> can't wait to try this tea. And yeah, I think it's a perfect tea for autumn. So, and it's a really cool design, by the way. I like the dark green color yeah another tea next up is the scratch card and we're gonna stretch it and it says no win better luck
that next time I see something that looks like a prince. What could this be? It has something to do with the Ministry of Magic. And something with a reward. Oh, oh. yeah, I like this. Oh, it says called Lucius Malfoy. Constant vigilance. Death eaters are among us. Remember, negligence costs life. If you have any information concerning Death Eaters, please contact your nearest horror office. Um, the Ministry of Magic is offering a reward of 1,000 galleons for information leading directly to the arrest of any Death Eater. We are left with two items, and it is the Wand and the Print. And we're going to go for the Print first. Save the best for last. I think <laughs> so the print I'm guessing that this has to do with the Goblet of Fire because that was the hint for this box and so far we didn't get any items that are directly relatable to the Goblet of Fire um, so yeah let's take a look yeah it is <laughs> yeah I thought so it had to be I mean Oh, this is quite cool. It says the Goblet of Fire and then there is a little piece of paper right here which says Harry Potter. And then you've got all these names in the background that represent the other people that got their name out of the Goblet of Fire. So Victor Crumb, Fleur de la Cour, uh, Cedric Diggory. The last item, as I said, is their wand from their unique wands trademark. And let's take a look. What is this? Oh, it's a dragon. Oh, sorry for the loud noise there. Um, wow. Wow. This is super detailed. Draco wand and the length is 13 and a half inches and the core is dragon heartstring. Yeah, <laughs> and the wood type is Hawthorne. Yeah, this is just an awesome looking wand and you have the scales on the back and the horns and the hat just looks really frightening. That is so cool. This is so cool for display purposes. It's not really practical because, I mean, you have horns sticking in your hand. Okay, so as always, a massive thank you and the items in the October box um, is the Basilix t-shirt, the Goblet of Fire print, the Unique Wands, the Draco Wands, the Tea Tin, the Amortensia Mini Mug, Lucius Malfoy poster, and the Basilisk Blood Tea. And next month's hint is Professor McGonagall. I'm so excited to see what they're going to do with that hint. What are they going to do with that hint? Also, I wanted to say a big thank you to you guys because you are watching my videos and are maybe subscribed to my channel and that is just so awesome. This experience is giving me so much joy and I need a bit of positivity in my life at the moment. So, and that is kind of why I started this YouTube channel eight weeks ago and now I am at 127 subscribers, which to me is a lot and that is just so cool and my next goal is to hit 200 subscribers and I'm hoping you guys want to help me with that and I promise you that when we hit 200 subscribers I'm going to do a magical giveaway um, which is going to be a box containing some of my Harry Potter and Disney items. So let's get to that 200 goal, 200 subscribers. And now, my favorite item from this box, a drum roll please, is the tea tin, because I don't have a tea tin, so this is my first, and that it is a Harry Potter themed one is just a big bonus for me, and I love that they put, I solemnly swear that I love my tea on there, and I just like the design, it is a really cool item to have, and yeah, 
I'm happy with this one but I have to say I love all the items in this box so I don't have a least favorite item and I thought it was a strong box the YouTube spotlight this is um <laughs> this is nice it's big Insy. I am um, uh, also subscribe to his channel and he is subscribed to my channel so if you're watching hi oh you guys oh my <laughs> Sorry, plants. I, uh, yeah. So that was, that's better. That was another magical unboxing. Uh, if you guys like this, please give it a thumbs up. And all that's left for me to say is have a magical day and let's stay in touch.